Hello there, everybody! It's Spider Knight 2 AK Nightmare, and welcome back to Disguise and 5 Alliance of Vengeance. And I got more DLC! And I also trained up quite a bit, like, seriously, I literally took way too much time and I trained a shit ton of my own. I still need to level him up a little bit more, but he's still pretty strong. Level up a little bit of everybody. Oh my god, 666. Six, six. I did not realize that at first. Triple Six! I like that. Oh yeah, there's Eternal Havoc, by the way. Uh, or Cyber uh -huh. Havoc. I don't know, who the hell are you? I am that one guy. He's that one guy. And Tyler and Agree back in level 1301. Alright. We're gonna go, since I found out that apparently you have to do certain requirements to unlock the next part of the post game, I'm gonna take the time to start doing more DLC episodes that just came out. So. Where would you like to go, dude? With this time, we are going to do. Hmm. I'm on, I think I can automatically assume that's the Overlord Zeta episode, and this is the Overlord Prie episode. So we are going to do the Overlord Prie episode. I heard that. <laughs> and the Dancing Demon. Well, here we go. Oh god, I wonder what level she's going to be. Like birds fly in the sky, like fish swim in the sea, demons seek power. The proof of their existence, the fight never ends for those enticed by power. Like a ship with its moor cut, they continuously drift, seeking strong opponents in big nether worlds. Hmm. Just a little more. Who is it? Hmm. What do you want? attack without saying anything, right? What are you trying to do? Yikes. You don't want to talk. Then... Don't take it personal. I'll make you talk. Huh. Okay, let's see what enemies level these. Oh, I know that music. Well, they're all level 800, huh? Seems a little under-leveled, really. Let's go. Ah, the memories of La Pucelle music. I got it! I got it! Is this the Italian music? I think this is like the first dungeon music from La Pucelle Tactics. Bring out good old Alter. I think the mushrooms were the only reoccurring demon in this game from La that would came from La Pucelle. Actually, yeah, I think the mushrooms actually did come from La Pucelle, and then it made its way to this guy. Oh my god, you guys gotta see this attack. I freaking have been geeking out about it. Check this out, the, the freaking Magic Knights version of the Neo Dimension Slash. Sonya! Three swords! Yeah. Booyah! Yeah. Uh, that was freaking There's awesome. Let's go. Wanna go? Jeez, my nostalgia senses are going crazy. Oh, speaking of which, if anybody else has discovered, they just announced that Disgaea will be coming to the PC. So look forward to that in February next year. Hopefully that'll mean like all the other Disgaea games might make it to PC. That'd be freaking awesome. Oh hell, even though I've already played the games, I'd definitely get it for PC. Comet Disaster! This map was easy. Good. Alfred surrendered. Alfred? What's Alfred doing here? I don't know. No. Oh. You tried to ambush me, but that's all you've got. What are you trying to accomplish? Hey, why don't you say anything? I'm sorry for the suddenness, Pooh. <laughs> I was testing your skills, Pooh. 
testing? What do you mean? A demon recently came to our netherworld looking for strong ones, Link. Muscles! She's been annoying, telling us to bring someone strong. Here I go. But no one in our netherworld can defeat Apu. She just beats everyone down. Yeah, that sounds like her. Well, I mean, she's that strong. Please, thank you for just helping us. Can you come with us, Link? Please? I have no choice. What do you want me to do? Thank you very much, Oink! I think, I'm pretty sure that's not the voice I was using for it, but I don't care. We'll contact you later. Please come to the location. We tell you to, Oink. Strong ones, huh? Oh boy, it's always with somebody strong. Blazing Spirit. So, this is the place. Mister! Sorry for making you wait, Oink. Now, over here, Overlord Prie is waiting. That didn't sound good. What is this? Muscle protection! This is where Overlord Prie trains. The walls collapse in time, so please be careful. Priye, what's up? Mm -mm. You must be Kilia. These guys told me about you. You're weak. Mm. You've got a great look in your eyes. It's been a while since I've met anyone who isn't afraid of me on sight. Why are you staying in this netherworld? Don't you want to fight strong ones? I don't think you'll find any here. Looks like you heard the gist of my situation. As you said, my wish is to fight someone strong. I came here because I heard there were a lot of strong foes. There aren't any worthy opponents back in my world. Mm. But look at this. Mm. The demons in this nether world are all talk. These prideless demons sell out as soon as they find out they can't win. I won't lose. I can't get stronger facing these guys. I want to fight more. I have to get even stronger. My god, what the hell happened to you? Well, ranting about it, how weak these guys are doesn't help. Plus, they're helpful in other ways. Like luring prey like me. How many people have you defeated using this tactic? Mm. I don't know. Not one of them was even worth remembering. I think it's time. Mm. Now, let the battle begin. I hope this fight will be memorable. Jesus! Oh, just her, huh? Level 1200. Good lord, that attack stat compared to all their other stats. Eh. Wow. She's got a devil matrix. Overlord free a class other overlord. At least the one with the book disappeared. Oh, yeah, at least the end. <laughs> Bundle attack. Increased damage dealt by empty panels in the attack range times 10%. Good god, that could synergize well with a lot of other abilities. Critical charge. Increase critical rate by attacks received this turn times 5%. Terrific counter. Increase attack by 40% when counterattacking. Seeking strength. Increase attack by 40% if an enemy's unit's attack is higher than yours. Huh. Atomic Super Blast. Holy Breaker. Requiem Aeternom. pre a change. Overlord's Hell. Does she have a she has an overlord. An overload. Blech. Priye's form after falling to darkness. She travels the netherworlds for strong opponents. Her busty body is dangerous. Did they really have to point out that... Yeah, they kind of had to point out that she's busty, I guess. Overload. Extreme Marduk. After fe defeating an enemy, take another action with decreased stats for one turn. Hmm. That's... Well, I mean, I guess that's... I'm not even sure how to respond to that, I guess. That's useful in its own ways, I guess. I need the name of the guy um, his name was Croy. Right. Yeah, like, that was her love interest. 
Why haven't they? Why haven't they brought him back? He would be way cooler than Kree, honestly. I would like to have both of them. That way, like, they have, they have their own little combo attack. Bring in Croy, and his overload would be transforming into. Oh, by, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Spoiler, spoilers. spoiler alert! Immediately, spoilers. spoiler alert! Immediately. Have like, have like, have Croy in the game. Have his overload transform into the Dark Prince. That would be so cool. That would be amazing. I mean, if Priya didn't care. And have, oh, and have Priya back in her nun form, and then whenever she has, and her overload instead would be to transform into her overlord form. I don't know why they didn't do that in the first place. Why didn't they do that? That would have been a really cool idea. I mean, I'm glad they put him in the game, but please, bring back Croy. Why does nobody like Croy? All right, here we go. Everyone likes him. Yeah, Croy's awesome. <laughs> oh, that's right, I remember, due to censorship laws, they kind of had to censor a lot of stuff from La Pucelle. I mean, his gun used to be like a cross rifle. Mm -hmm. And he was actually smoking in the um, original Japanese, he actually had a cigarette, and they kept... You can see the animations in the English version, but yeah. there's no... Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm not paying attention. Okay. Ow! <laughs> it's just a scratch. Just but a scratch! I'll show you a real attack. Ultimate demon technique! Ultimate skill! That will cause him! That did less! Ow. That wasn't very nice. No, you know what? I'm not gonna play nice. Sorry. Denied. Yeah, she's got quite a bit of HP. Then again, I'm not surprised. Let's go. Like wow. Boiling. Tyra Rebellio. Hey, Overlord Prie, say hello to Tyrant Overlord Kalidia. Ultimate demon technique! Ultimate skill! Back will cause him! Oh yeah. Hmm. Let me thank you. You missed. Uh oh. Oh yeah, that's right, Holy Saber should do more damage because she's technically a monster unit. Yeah! Oh yeah, we still have, oh yeah, we're getting ready to test that out, haven't we? I want to see what happens when I... Oh, I, I, oh yeah, yeah, I got it equipped. Alright, let's see what happens then. Oh, she's still using the Requiem Aetronom. And I just realized I, sh I still had a, another action with Kilia and I did not capitalize on that. And I am an idiot. <laughs> I was going to laugh at you over the counters. Blood boiling. Here we go! Shadow Phantom. Hmm. Now it's my turn. Stay alert. No Ow. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Ow. You missed. <laughs> Atomic Super Blast. <laughs> That's because it is new. Wait, no, it's not. I remember seeing this in Disguise V2. Did you think that was actually going to hurt us? Hey 
gotta say, the skill system in Lafusel was a lot harder. Oh my god, the skill system in Lafusel was ridiculously hard. But you got used to it after hours. And one thing I one thing I never understood about the the um, English the American release of La Pucelle was that they removed the ability to do um, multiple um, runs. Okay. Like they re they removed yeah they re they removed the new game plus option in the American release. Ironically, the European release kept that function. Maybe there was some Good. after game stuff they just didn't want to get to. Like the ability to actually recruit a freaking succubus or stuff like that, recruit Bale. Yeah! I mean, you can still do that in one playthrough, but it takes a ridiculously large amount of time. Because you had to do the whole yeah. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. If you wanted to go get a succubus so early in the game, Good. yeah. In in Labu I remember there were only two opportunities that you had to get a freaking Good. succubus. One, you had to get the Demon Lord title, and oh, yeah, I'm mean, hell. I'll explain later. It's hard. It's difficult. It's extremely difficult. I think I did it. Get ready. Hooray, Master! You beat Priapu! Way to go! Wait! You're weak. <laughs> I can't do the laugh. I haven't gotten this pumped in a while. You're excellent, Kelia. That's a very that's a very masculine voice, and I am You're terrible. Me. I cannot do female voices. I want to fight with you more, but only when you're on your best condition. When you're prepared, come back. Mm. I don't care if you try to run away, but you know what'll happen if you do, right? She did the pray. She 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 did the pray thingy. Will I be able to defeat her again? The demon known as Prie. Oh boy. Alright, time for fight results. You're weak. You're finally here. Then let's get started. Tell me one thing. Why do you fight? To seek power? Huh? What do you mean, why? Power is what demons seek. Power is proof of my existence. To prove my powers, I exist to fight. No, power is a method. It's not an objective. A person should get stronger to protect others, or to accomplish something. Mm. Hmm? That's what it means to you? Is that because you have someone to protect or something to accomplish? I see. You still have those. I understand what you're trying to say. I was like that in the beginning, too. Huh? What? In the beginning? That's right. To get stronger for more important reasons, that's how I thought in the beginning. I'm not that smart, so I figured that if I just got stronger, I wouldn't lose to anything. As it turns out, you need great motivation to do things for others, but it can make miracles happen. From the bottom of my heart, I believed in that spark, that light from a person. That's what I believed. Hey, Kilia, can you still believe in that light? You look like you've had experience with that, too. Netherworlds aren't made from kindness. When confronted with real power, you don't stand a chance protecting others. After all, it all comes down to power. Without it, you can't protect a single thing. It'll all be taken from you. Jesus, what the hell happened? You couldn't forget it, right? There's no way you can. I sought power to get back everything I had. I wasn't going to lose to anyone. I didn't want to lose any more. Or anything anymore. Then... I gained the power of an overlord. I gained the power that took away everything from me. But I still couldn't save anything. I was left with nothing. Except for one thing. 
This power. This overwhelming power that ruins everything. I am this power. Using it proves that I exist. Prie, you... You're me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's just an excuse so we can have a good, simple fight. The reasons doesn't matter anymore. I just want to fight. You're me. Now, let's get to it. So... I don't know, I'm, I, part of me is confused because... Did she actually lose everything? I'm guessing that's probably what it was. Oh, she's level 1500 now, huh? Hmm. The stats aren't that different except for the 100% critical boost and her abilities are still the same. Oh boy. Oh, this is gonna still gonna be fun. Oh, but that nostalgic music. Yes! Where is the new prey? Let me pick on you. Set. We, the four of us, will share the power of bonds. Mm. Whoa! Yes! Jesus. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I guess everybody, I guess the Demon Lord ending is canon, I guess. I don't know, maybe it's just specifically for the game she appears in, I don't know. Her human form did appear in a disguised D2, I know that much. A lot of dark things seem to happen about herself. Well, yeah. To every single person. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe the reason that she appears like this is because something happened in that, um... It was the PSP port that they never released in America of La Pucelle called La Pucelle Ragnarok. Supposedly it had a focused story around Overlord Prie. Like what happens whenever she go, whenever she became a demon lord. That's what I... That's the only thing I can assume. Oh well. I'm not wanting to cough. <laughs> God damn. Good. All right, gang, you ready? Together! Yeah. Let's go! Oh yeah, for those of you who are probably confused by this, I went ahead and got this ability called Beetle Size. Evade attacks at the rate of 75%, but damage taken will be 10. It just says 10. I don't know if that's like 10 times the amount of damage, or just you'll only get hit with 10 HP damage. I I literally have no idea. 
Well, we don't get to see me get hit off stage a lot. Yeah, you could probably just Google that and figure it out. Keep using that. I was kind of hoping to use another skill, to be honest. Um, that atomic blast thingy. Obviously, Requiem Aderon. Ooh! Good! Okay, well, let's test that out then, shall we? Alright. Let's go, everyone! What the hell? <laughs> we are not your airplanes or your air ski. What the fuck? Oh. Oh my god. So that's what happens when you get hit. Yeah, ten times the amount of damage. Huh. Huh. I'm okay with this. Okay. Overload. God damn it. <laughs> Ugh, well, god crap, my overload's not built up yet. You should totally both have that. The healing will be too strong. The healing is strong, this is fine. Whatever. Get me out of the way. Sonya, do it! Yeah. Oh, elemental cataclysm. Why didn't they name it that? And eh, whatever. Let's go! Use me as your weapon! <laughs> nope, I do not. All right, Alter, you do it. Yeah. Hm. I right. crud. This is going to hurt quite a lot. Yeah, hopefully you don't get hit. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting her make her attack makes it to where the And now my ability activates. Indomitable spread. Phantasm has been mastered. Oh, huh, cool. Looks like I'm glad they changed her in the first game. What? You can't dodge your allies. Oh, yeah. You used to be able to dodge your allies' healing abilities, and that was... Uh, Everyone! We shall go together! Let's go! I got one! Charge! You missed. Ow. Use something please. other than Requiemator on, please! She's so happy, she can use it so easily now. Oh my god! She doesn't have to do these stupid bosses of making squares. Oh god, that was a pain in the toilet, because you couldn't even have to, you didn't even have to make squares, you just had, actually, you kind of just had to make it all freaking connect. You had to hope and pray. You had to hope and pray. Yes. Be, like Fred, be like Frederick from freaking Fire Emblem. Pick a god and pray. Better when he's telling people to go to lay. Pick a cotton lay. Better when he's in traffic. Pick a lane and stay. I can't think of any others. 
I give up. I can't think of any others. Ta-da! Yes. Oh boy. That's that's not enough. Let's keep fighting. Jura, she's strong. I can't fight any longer, but I can't leave Prie like this. Kilia, let's go. Prie? I went a little too far. Hm. How unfortunate. How are your injuries? They're all right, but don't worry about it. But I owe you. Thanks. On the other hand, I'm surprised you can still move. You're all worn out. My body moved instinctively. Hmm? Really? For other people, huh? Did you say something? It's nothing. I was just talking to myself. Mm. By the way, we didn't finish our fight. I was so close to defeating you. Well, you had no choice. You were all torn up. Mm. No excuses. What should I do? Ah. Alright, I've decided. I'll protect you from now on. I don't want you to lose to anyone. You can fight me anytime. Plus, I'll find lots of opponents with you. It's like killing two birds with one stone. Eesh. No, it's not. So let's keep it up, Kilia. Overlord Prie became an ally. Hmm. Yeah, alright. Now that that's settled, we need to go greet everyone in this netherworld. Why do I have a feeling that your way of greeting people might end up a in may end up resulting in a very large hospital bill? You're weak. Is there anyone who can incite me? Oh my god. Oh. Hospital more than you thought. Yeah. Dude. Grr! Dude. <laughs> Grr! dude. Yeah. What's going on, dude? Is this really okay? No, you invited a mon- you basically invited a very violent woman to the team. Alright, where is she? Where did she go? I wanna talk to her. There is she. Priye! Where are you? Seriously, where the hell are you? Priye? No, that's Adele. Where are you? You can't hide from me. Seriously, where the hell- oh, hi, Nisa. And check it out, I got Nisa. Jump over. She's clearly not up here. Where are you? Get, 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 get away from me. Not you guys. Hey, Salvatore, I see you over there. And she's over here somewhere. Oh, she's up here somewhere. Seriously, where the fudge nugget is she? No, no. I want to talk to her. Where the heck is she? Maybe I missed her. Well, she should be here somewhere. There we go. Feel like a bit of an overview. That way we can look at every angle. You know what? Screw it. I give up. Oh, wait, I'm, go I'm going to the hospital. Let's fix you up. Jesus. So, yeah, there she is. Over Pandemonium. An absolute weapon that absorbs its victims. Oh, well, yeah, that is the actual name of her weapon, I think. Uh. Well, well, you know, guys, I got... I got her. Well, guess what? Oh, by the way, yeah, say hello to Metalia. Nisa. 
Anyway, so, next episode, while I'm still trying to figure out how to unlock the various post games, we're going to do the next DLC mission, which will be Overlord Zeta. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.